Alright, so you're in your island and you want to import custom assets. This is very simple. What you're going to do is when you have your downloaded asset, which mine is here, right here, right here uh, just keep that with you in one separate uh, tab. And what you want to do is you want to go to the content drawer down here, click it, and then go down to where it says your named island and then the content. Make sure you click on it and then press add. We're in when you're in add, press new folder, and then call this anything you want. I'm just going to call it imported, or import, and then I'm just going to press enter, and then go into that folder. folder. Uh, then what you want to do is you want to drag and drop both files, your texture and your 3D model. So I'm just going to import it. Make sure that you have this true, because if you don't, then you're going to be able to walk through it if you, if you have it as false. So make sure it's true and then import all. Make sure you don't import, just import all. Now I'm going to ignore these um, uh, error messages, but you probably won't have error messages. I do, just in my case. It's a different case, don't worry about it. Uh, so right now, as you can see, I've got my model here. What I'm going to do is going to drag it in. And as you can see, if you it, it already creates the uh, material here when you've imported the texture with it. So this is a bit small for my liking, so I'm just going to make it bigger. I'll do now. There we go. So I made it bigger, and now it's it's literally done. That's all you need to do. All you need to do is just save all, and then you just launch session. So I'll show you now. Perfect. So uh, as you can see, you can't walk through it as we made that collision, and we set it to true. And yeah, that's basically how you import custom assets.